Eight years ago, UMass Lowell, with its partners, was awarded one of only four National Science Foundation nano manufacturing centers in the US. This became the nucleus of a multidisciplinary faculty effort. Over 40 faculty, many of who are in the crowd today, experts in a broad range of fields, polymers, nanomedicine, electromagnetics. The state, as the chancellor mentioned, contributed a matching five million in order to emphasize economic development. This state match has led to a greater than eight to one return on investment. Over $43 million in external research funding, over six million of that from industry partners. Because of this funding, many of our undergraduate and graduate students have had the opportunity to learn by experience, to hands-on experience in the laboratory, and to benefit from our rapidly expanding co-op program, having the chance to work with industry. These students have now joined the Massachusetts workforce at both large and small companies. Companies such as Raytheon, Boston Scientific, NIPRO, and Triton Systems. They bring with them, when they go to these companies, the knowledge that they have gained here. Knowledge that helps to strengthen the competitiveness of our companies in the global marketplace. Today, on this beautiful New England fall day, with the formal opening of the Emerging Technologies and Innovation Center, we are moving to the next level. With the support provided by the state, with the support provided by the Massachusetts Life Science Center that provided $10 million to finish the nanomedicine floor, with the support of the many industry partners and sponsors and donors that are here today, the vision that we had for the ETIC many years ago is today a reality. So many people have helped to make this happen. So many faculty who are here today have contributed. This new state-of-the-art building positions us to compete for federal initiatives in things like advanced manufacturing and to address the important and complex challenges that face all of us today in health, in energy, in security. As friends and family here today of the UMass Lowell community, I encourage all of you after these events to tour the building, to talk to the students, to talk to our Nano Center co-directors, and to look at the posters that are in the hallways that talk about the exciting research discoveries and the products that, that they are working to develop. Today is a great day to celebrate, and all of you should be proud as contributors to this effort. This, this building, ETIC, is a reality today because of everyone here. Thank you very much. <laughs>